If you're a business owner, you have got to meet our good friend, Josh Zaglowski, co-founder of ERC Specialists. He's standing up like no one else against the threat of lockdowns. And you're going to love this. His business, ERC Specialists, is a specialty payroll company exclusively dedicated to understanding and maximizing what's called the CARES Act Employee Retention Credit. So that's what ERC stands for, Employee Retention Credit. It's for small businesses affected negatively by past shutdowns. If you're a small business owner looking to get up to $26,000 per employee back from bumbling Biden and cackles Kamala, click on that link in the description below to see if you qualify today. This really is an amazing opportunity for you. I, um, I was with you that day in Gettysburg when Doug Mastriano officially announced his gubernatorial campaign. Now you have to remember, I'm not from Pennsylvania. I'm unfortunately from um, Delaware. Yeah, 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 rub it in, go ahead, rub it in, there you go. Take your shots. Yeah, I live about 20 minutes away from uh, Brandon's basement. Uh, I've, I've said, you know, if you go out on my porch around New Day, if it's quiet enough, you can actually hear him snoring. It's really cute. <laughs> Certainly isn't doing much else. But I told you on that day that the whole nation was going to be watching you. The entire country was going to be watching Pennsylvania. And boy, did I get proven right. The whole nation has its eyes on Pennsylvania and especially this gubernatorial campaign. For some reason, uh, Sean Insanity has his eyes on the Senate campaign as well. Yeah, there's a little Murdoch money there, I think. And we all know that one set of eyes see you all as very, very bad. You're, you're, you're very bad boys and girls today, because you know what you did. You know what you did today, right? You, you voted in such a way that you didn't listen to the Philadelphia Inquirer. And they're very upset about that. Oh, you, look, look at how bad you are. Celebrate that. You refuse to vote the way that Harrisburg wants you to vote. Oh, you're very bad boys and girls. You also refuse to vote the way that Mitch McConnell and Lindsey Graham want you to vote. You're all very bad little girls and boys because you refuse to vote the way the permanent political class wants you and demands you to vote. <laughs> now, the Philadelphia Inquirer and CNN, they're... Uh, they're not going to be very nice to you over the next several months. You see, they, they really don't like what you do. They're going to accuse you of all kinds of things. They're going to call you all kinds of names. They're going to call you LGBTQ, but they're going to leave out the LGBT part. Let's see if you're with me there. All right. <laughs> there you go. That's right. That's, that's what Trump would do. The fake news out there. The fake news. They're going to accuse you of all kinds of things. They're going to slander you. They're going to call your names, maybe like Ultra Maga. That's what one set of eyes is looking at you with tonight. But let me tell you about another set of eyes. These are eyes like mine that don't live in Pennsylvania. For these eyes, you are heroes. You're part of a massive patriot uprising, declaring for all the world to hear that you are free men, and free men will not be ruled. Tonight, you are the voice for tens of of millions of us all across the country who have had it with our permanent political class. We've had it with politics as usual. We've had it with a political elite that hates our values, 
despises our concerns and rules according to their own interests at the expense of the interests of the people. And you stood up today and you were our voice. You have announced for all to hear that the days of the permanent political class are over. And the era of the Patriot has just begun. You are why the tide is turning all throughout the nation. You're the reason why we're seeing more people than ever run to the Republican Party. We're seeing suburban moms join a movement that will effectively push back against all the shocking and creepy curriculum being taught in our schools. We're seeing Latinos join a movement that celebrates conservative values and defends the integrity of our borders. Yes. We're seeing working class men and women join a movement that actually wants to protect our manufacturing and industrial jobs, not ship them overseas. We're seeing in you what happens when the light of faith, family, and freedom rekindles and shines for all the world to gaze at. You are the reason woke insanity is retreating literally everywhere. You're the reason bumbling Biden's approval numbers are in a perpetual freefall. And thanks a lot, because the farther they go down, the more he comes back to Delaware. You're the reason patriot parents are storming woke school boards like never before. And you are the reason that Roe v. Wade is in the process of being struck down by the Supreme Court. And tonight, to add all to that, you're the reason that Doug Mastriano is about to become the next governor of Pennsylvania. The Patriot Movement has arrived and the nation is watching. Because of you, a new era of faith, family, and freedom has just begun. It's your time to shine. You know how this is going to end tonight. Shine all the way to November. We're watching and we're hoping in you. God bless.